Hello from Myrtle Beach. Today we are on Kings Highway. We're going to drive northbound on Kings Highway. We're going to show you all the restaurants, all the entertainment, all the shopping, everything on Kings Highway, which is also known as 17 Business. Hi, I'm Carmen. If you're new here, we cover everything Myrtle Beach and the surrounding area. Welcome. And if you're a return viewer, thanks so much for coming back. We're glad to have you. We're going to start here, like I mentioned, on the south end and head north. Over there on the right, we've got the Cancun Putt-Putt. That is an indoor Putt-Putt course. So if it's a rainy day, that's a great rainy day activity. But I wanted to show you, I'm actually gonna pan over here so you can see it, the progress on the Red Dragon Golf Course. That is a brand new Putt-Putt course that is coming to the area. Uh, it's the first one we've had, a new one in many years. Uh, so we're excited to see that coming. We will definitely keep you posted. So if you're interested in that, definitely subscribe to the channel so you won't miss the update when that's ready we will absolutely go check it out and uh, play a game we like we like putt-putt leave it in the comments and let us know uh, do you enjoy putt-putt or mini golf or for our Canadian friends mini putt uh, is that something that you enjoy playing um, lots and lots of things on Kings Highway as you can see there are a lot of putt-putt courses here's another one on the left uh, so whatever your theme preference, you will be able to find uh, a putt-putt course with that theme, most likely. And then the other big draw on Highway 17 Business or Kings Highway is the restaurants. There are lots and lots and lots of restaurants. Um, there's Captain D's. And they're hiring. Everyone's hiring. Um, if you're looking for a job, it seems like everyone's hiring in Myrtle Beach. I see hiring signs absolutely everywhere. There's also a lot of uh, surf shops, beach shops, souvenir shops. Uh, there's a Dollar General. Um, there's also small grocery places on this road. You're not going to see like really big grocery stores, but there are a couple of places you can get groceries. Um, there's a couple of or several red dot stores if you're not familiar with South Carolina laws that's where you go to buy liquor um, and you can't go to the grocery store and buy liquor you can get beer and wine at the grocery store but not liquor and so there's one right there that I mentioned I've got Villa Roma pizza all kinds of stuff like I said just every variety of food you can imagine every ethnicity of food um, all different types of varieties as well as fast food like the Burger King here and if you're wondering where this is this is uh, westbound from Ocean Boulevard you know Ocean Boulevard is that main drag there's Captain Benjamin's Calabash seafood which a lot of people mentioned they like and I'm gonna pan over here to show you Family Kingdom this is a very large amusement park and right on the other side of Family Kingdom there is Ocean Boulevard that I was just mentioning and so that's how close we are to Ocean Boulevard so if you're staying on Ocean Boulevard I would say this is in walking distance I mean it's it's a good walk I'm not gonna make it sound trivial but this is definitely in walking distance um, it doesn't mean that where your hotel is there will be something you want to walk to over here but uh, definitely could stroll over here and see what's nearby Another beachware shop, Krispy Kreme, Noisy Oyster, Waffle House, like I mean, all, all different kinds of things. What's your favorite, if you're familiar with Kings Highway, what is your favorite thing on Kings Highway? Is it a restaurant? Is it a putt-putt course? Is it some other type of entertainment or shopping? Let us know in the comments below. That's a huge beach store over there. As you can see, there are a few churches as well. So if you're here and you want to look for a church, there's the First Baptist. And we're also going to pass the uh, very large Methodist church in a couple of minutes as well. But, you know, a lot of people ask me, where do I go to eat? You know, all that kind of thing. There's always the big entertainment districts like Broadway at the Beach and Barefoot Landing. But if you want something a little closer, like I said, this is definitely a good place. You'll, you'll be able to find something you like here. There's another very large putt-putt course. I believe it's called Mount Atlanticus. And then we think this zip line is closed, but we can't say that for sure. Let us know in the comments if you know for sure. Uh, it might just be closed for the season. We'll find out as uh, things start opening back up. And here's the main parking deck. Looks like they're doing a little work on it. 
Uh, people always ask where to park. This is 9th Avenue North um, and Kings Highway. That's where this parking deck is. And then there's the Methodist Church that I mentioned, the large Methodist Church. Uh, you do have to pay in this parking deck. And also there's some street parking, but it is limited. And that is everywhere from you have to pay for it. It's like right up and down this street right here to if you go far enough away, some of it is free but limited to two or three hours. There's all different types. So you have to always check the meters because it varies depending on where you're parking. There's Mammy's Kitchen up on the right. Uh, let us know if you've eaten there before and if you like it. I've heard from a lot of you that you do like it. They have a uh, big breakfast buffet and uh, they also serve lunch. I don't think they're open for dinner there. We've got some people in there enjoying the breakfast buffet. Or is it lunch time? No, we're still in breakfast time. So yeah, we always get questions about what time was this filmed. Uh, this was filmed about 9.30 in the morning. Uh, so just to give you an idea. So this is 9.30 traffic. And we're not in prime summer season yet either. Uh, it will we'll get a lot more traffic as the season moves on. And that church right there that we are passing is the one that uh, is actually closed and they are converting it into an entertainment center of some kind. Um, I think it's going to have a bar and some other things, uh, so that's going to be different. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, this is a very large park. There's a lot of festivals and stuff in this park right here. There's Cafe Old Vienna. Uh, that has been in Myrtle Beach for quite some time. Uh, you may have seen the ads on Beach TV if you watch that in your hotel room. Uh, we have not eaten there yet. Let us know in the comments if you liked it, if you've eaten there. Uh, but the chef is from Austria, so it's authentic uh, food from Vienna. Coastal Outfitters General Store. And so you can see right over here, oh, there's some guys walking on the roof there, all the big high-rise hotels. So that's Ocean Boulevard. There's that new courtyard, uh, Spring Hill Suites by Marriott. There are a lot of lights on uh, Kings Highway. So if you're looking for a quicker way to get from one end to the other, uh, north to south or south to north, definitely go a little west there is the 17 bypass that is the road that uh, Broadway at the beach is on for a frame of reference uh, it's on one side of that road uh, this has some fun theming I think hooks uh, putt putt we definitely like that one that's one of my favorites uh, I like the Peter Pan theming I find that fun <laughs> nostalgia probably Where do you stay when you come to Myrtle Beach? Do you stay oceanfront? Do you stay second row, which is the across the street from the ocean? Or do you stay a little further inland, like on a golf course or on the waterway? What's your preference uh, when you come to Myrtle Beach? I think most of you are gonna stay oceanfront. Uh, if you can afford it, that's definitely a great place to stay, but the prices have just gotten crazy. Um, they've always been high, but the oceanfront prices, I think, have gotten really crazy here, especially in the summer. And Kings Highway will continue going for a long ways from here, uh, continuing with more pup putt more restaurants, all of that good stuff. If you've enjoyed this video, be sure to click on the video on your screen right now and click subscribe so you won't miss anything new. Thanks so much for watching. Until our next adventure.